Welcome to Chair Fitness. I'm Michaela. We're about to have a really incredible class. I want you to have fun. I want you to stay fit. And I want you to do some things. You ready? Go ahead and step behind your chair. Open up your legs. I want you to lightly touch the top of your chair. Now we're moving the hips from side to side. Keep going. I'm going to step beside my chair so you can see that the hips move, but the legs don't. The legs are straight. The hips rock from side to side. I want a quick flip to the right. So flip and trace down your left leg. Good. Go to the lowest point and then slide up your chair. Go back to shaking. Let's do the same to the left. So trace, two, three, four, and up. Good. Go back to that shift from side to side. We're gonna turn this into a hip sway. So you dip, push right. So as you can see, I'm kind of hiding my hips behind the chair, and then I'm poking them out from side to side. Keep going, I'm gonna step to the side till you see it. I want you to dig a little lower this round. So take the hips low. Yeah, dig. We're starting to activate those glutes, waking them up for your last round. Really drop, drop, lift. Peeking and hiding the hips. Fingertips are still light. Your posture is still tall. Let's stand up, face right. Give me a slow strut. So your strut is a sexy walk. If you have on high heels, be very careful. Take that extra step for balance. Switch direction and speed it up. One, two, three. Good. I'm keeping my finger on the top of the chair just for balance. Let's end in front of the chair. Give me a little wiggle. We call it a sizzle. That's where you make your entire body move like an S. Good, up with the right, and up with the left. We're going to sizzle down to the chair, flip, and do it again. Sizzle down to the chair, flip. I need two more. Try not to miss that opportunity to trace. So here's an opportunity. And even on the sizzle, there's an opportunity to trace. Good, hold it. Open and close. Open, close. So we're really engaging the hips. Open up the inner thighs. Good, hold. Let's trace down your left leg. Kick it out. Open up, flex, point, flex. Try it down the right. Trace, catch, lift, flex, point. Okay, give me a few more. Nice, come on down. Bring the arms up, cuff. Cuff the arms and pull up. Yeah, it's like you're being cuffed, handcuffed. Excellent. Open up, open, open up the chest. All right, go ahead and grab a towel, a shirt, a lightweight, something like we're gonna move into our arm workout. Little arms, so grab something. I have a robe here, got a little robe. Whatever you have, come to your seat. Hold it in your right arm or your right hand. Arm up, whip this thing around. Now I want the shirt, towel, or weight to circle above the head. 
Yeah, and the arms stay straight. Switch direction, same arm. Yeah, it's like drawing a halo over your head. Good, keep going right here. So we're really gonna try to isolate the shoulder here by keeping the elbow flat, keeping the arm long. Let's reverse, this time add a little stomach to it. So roll, roll right in your chair. Activating the abs, giving me little crunches. Yeah, arm hurt yet? <laughs> reverse, ah, keep it above the head. Nice, hips, abs, shoulders. Come on down, switch hands. Doesn't matter which direction, because we're working evenly in both directions. Now with this left arm, keep the arm straight. Let the shoulder do most of the work. Nice. Reverse. Right above the head. Don't let that object creep outside of the line of the body. Keep it up. Five, six, seven. Switch, add the abs. Roll. Nice. My robe is like, what's going on? It keeps trying to lengthen. It's like, I'm not supposed to be whipped. Yes, it is. <laughs> Reverse. Whoop. Working so good. Tell them, Sierra. Four to go. Four. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. We're going to continue this warm up. Go ahead and toss that shirt to the side if you have a weight. Don't toss that. <laughs> Turn, to the, uh, turn your chair to the side. Mount your chair facing the back. Place both fingertips on the top of the chair. Body wave, roll, crunch. Now, no matter which part of the move I'm performing, I'm keeping that 45 degree incline. So keep the leg back. Take your right arm and reach it back, two. So we're working abs, working them and using them to stabilize. Six, seven, switch. Take a little liberty with how far you can lay. You can also hold the back of your chair if you really wanna go low. Six, seven, let's switch, let's do that. Lay back, crunch. So this really isolates the abs here. Less shoulders, so all the focus is on the abs. Excellent. Let's switch. Roll. So you're holding on to the leg of the chair for stability. If you can lean back this far and still keep your balance, do it. Both hands on. We're gonna add a little squat. So roll, sit, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, come on down. That was really, really good. All right, we're gonna actually turn and set up for dips and push-ups, okay? So with your dips, you're gonna grab a nice thick part of your chair, okay? The focus is the triceps worked by the elbow, right? The elbow moves, the triceps work. So grab that meaty part of your chair. Yeah. Go ahead and uh, let your hips come off the seat of your chair. Down for four. We go down, two, three, four, and push. Watch my hips. Notice how the hips stay low. They don't lift. Two, two, here we go. Down, two, up, two, down, A. Down, two, up, two. Four, four, down, two, three, bend, squeeze. Yeah, how about those singles coming up? Single count, down. Two, three, four, keep going. 
going. Five, keep going. We're gonna add a little knee work here. Down, up, down, A. Butterfly, nice. Stay up, shake, A, A. So the arms are straight. Shake the hips. Six, seven, drop low and pulse. Pulse. Two, keep going. Three, four, I'm gonna turn. Five, six, seven. Little bounce for the eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. No chair. Keep it bouncing. Two, squeeze the glutes. And three, shoulders back. And four, A, A, five, A, six. Can we turn? Twerk around the world. It's a one, two, three, four, five. Hands on the chair. Slowly stretch. Make the legs go straight. And then we flutter the knees. Yeah, just take this little active recovery. Because we're going into push-ups. Grab a nice meaty part of your chair. Give me a slant through your straight legs. Keep your shoulders over your hands. We're gonna take the forehead to the chair. Forehead. Chin. Chest. Push up. Let me see it. Forehead. Chin. Chest. Push up. Speed it up. Here we go. Down. Up. Two. Up. Three. All right. Take it down and hold. Hold. Two. Hold it. Three. Four. Hold it. Five. Six. Seven. Push up. Flutter those legs. A. <laughs> Very good. Come on back to your chair. Turn it forward. Excellent, guys. Arms up. Push. Push. A. A. Push. A. Raise the root. Give me full extension. Good. Push. Excellent. Shake those arms out. We're going to come down to the floor. Okay? We're going to do some bridge work, specifically for the glutes and the hamstrings. So, you're going to lay on the floor or a mat. This is my floor. So I know it's clean, so I'm going to lay on my floor. Okay. I'm going to mount my heels up on top of the chair. I'm going to lay on my hands just to keep my hair off the floor. All right. I want you to activate the glutes right here. We're bridging up for two. Up, two, down, two, up, two, down. Good. So you can lay on the hands or bring them out to the side. Up, two, up and hold, hold, hold it. I'm flashing y'all here. I didn't mean to flash y'all. Hey, we're going to bounce. Six, seven, bounce. Hey, hey, bounce. You got this. Five, six, seven. Come on down. Bring the knees into the chest for a quick little stretch. We're going back. Heels on top. We're going up. Two, three, four, and down. Remember, the activation of your glutes. That's the first move. Two, two, squeeze, lift. It's always the squeeze first. Take your hips as high as they'll go. Up and hold. Hold, hold. Eight, eight, five, six. 
seven, relax, knees in, eight, we're almost done, almost done, heels back on, cross one leg over the other, and go, Whoop. two, so I have my, my right over my left, which means more, the focus is mostly on the left, two, two, Whoop. Whoop. Two more. Let's switch legs. Come on down. Switch legs. More Megan the Stallion. Yeah, I know. She's my type of girl. <laughs> All right, we switch. Two, two. Up, two. Down, two. Squeeze here. Three. Four to go. Stay with me. Whoop. Buns on fire, hamstrings two. One more. Excellent, bring the knees into the chest. All right, let's bring it up. Bring it up sexy if you can. Hey. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go into some chair squats. I know I told you that we wouldn't double up on body parts. But I have this tendency to tell mistruths all for the sake of good fitness. So don't be upset with me, okay? <laughs> all right, we're gonna start with forward facing chair squats. So I want you to open up your legs, okay, get a nice sturdy, sturdy footing. If you have on sneakers, you probably are gonna go wider. If you have on high shoes, you're probably gonna bring it in a little so that your heels can really dig into the floor. Okay, your hands start on your knees. Up for two, down for two. Up, two, down, two. Now we are online. So if you're hearing the music a little differently than I am, check the move and catch your beat. Catch the beat that you hear. Nice. Three and one. Up, two, three. Up, two, three. Hey, hey. Good. Single. Up. Squeeze the glutes. Sit on the chair. We sit there. Good. Have a seat. Quickly shake. Quickly shake. Hey. Shake the legs out, shake them out. Cause now we're gonna lift one or two inches off the chair. I said an inch, not a mile. We're gonna lift an inch and hold the ISO squat. Ready? Let's do it here. Hey, this is my song y'all. Hold it, bring the hips super low to the chair. Good. Touch the chair on every bounce. Touch it, touch it, touch it. Squeeze it. If you're feeling this in your knees and you don't have arthritis, squeeze the glutes extra hard. Bounce. Two. I wanna see your chest. I wanna see your face. Five. Six. Seven. Flip. Stretch it out. Eight, eight. I'm like, what you ate for breakfast? <laughs> Lift your chair. I want you to sit facing forward, but you're facing the back of your chair. We have the aid of the chair top now, but we're not gonna depend on it too much. Just a light little touch. Same goes. Two, two. Up, two. Down, two. I want you to dig the hips into the floor. Lightly sit on your chair and fully sit on your chair. Three and one. Up, two, three, sit, keep going. I want to show you the posture that I need. So you're not going to lean into the chair. You go up, two, Three, you see how the upper body doesn't really change? 
That's what I need. One, two, three. Single count. Up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Have a seat. Shake it out. A, A, A. Shake it out. <laughs> Stay right here. Hold on to the top of your chair. We're going to do some flashes. So your flash is knees up. Toes out, knees in, now you. Up, out. I want the highest, straightest legs that you can give me. A. Speed it up just a little. Up, out. Now if you have on high shoes, you got a little bonus. Those shoes act like weights. So I know these shoes with these heavy platforms are really helping me build muscle and burn calories. Yep. Y'all know what's coming. Speed it up, quick flash. Flash and down. Two and down. Three, kick up there. Don't kick at me. Kick up there. You're flashing someone or something, right? Two more, up. Can we lift and hold for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Can y'all see the sweat on my face? I am sweating. Let's flip our chair again. We're gonna flip it to the side. Ah, no, I lied, I lied. You're gonna flip it forward. You're gonna flip it forward. Let's give the legs a little break. Just a little tiny one. So, the chair is facing forward, but I'm facing on a side view. You're gonna take your back arm and let it rest on your chair if you need to. Otherwise, just let it hang. Okay, we wanna lay back into like a 45 degree angle. Again, if you can do this without holding on to your uh, legs, your seat legs, do that. Otherwise, hold on for stability. We're gonna raise that left knee and kick up, two. Now, I know I said give the legs a break. You gotta realize, that's comparatively speaking. Those squats, they feel a lot worse than this little leg lifting up. And we're working the abs here as well. Singles. Now this front shoulder, your left shoulder, let it hang back. Retract it, lift and point at it, point at it. I see you, I see you foot, six, seven. We lower the leg, so lower it, touch it. Open the hand. So the arm is an option to focus on the upper abs. The legs take care of the lower abs. The shoulder and arm incorporates the upper ab. Catch the beat. Up, two, crunch. The focus is right here. Six, seven, catch and hold. Catch the leg. Pull it in as high as you can. Go ahead and point the toe. Take your left hand and trace down. Two, three, four, five. Guess what? Let go with the other. Eight, seven, hold it, six, five, four, three, you did it. Put it down. We're going to switch. Good job. Let's turn to the left. It's the same setup. Arm goes on top. Good, lean back, lay back. Remember, you can do this without holding on, that's gangster. That's beast mode, but you can also understand where you are in life and just hold on to the chair. There's no guilt. All right, bring the knee up. Up, two, down, two, up. Now, the knee placement, that sets you up for a high leg. So if your knee is low, 
your leg won't go high. Get that knee up super high. Whoop. Hey, hey. Nice. Bring the right shoulder back for singles. Up, hey, up. Kick it up. Work the quads. Five, six, seven. Point at it. Uh, I see you. I see you shaking leg. I see you working hard leg. Six, seven. Ab work. Down, tap. Open, tap. We got this, y'all. Four more. Open the abs, crunch them. Lower body works on the lower abs. Upper body, upper abs. Catch the beat. Open, crunch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Catch it. Catch it. Retract your shoulders. Point the toe. Engage the abs. Let's trace. Down. Two, three, four, five, six. Get ready. Let it go. For eight, 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 seven, six. Hold that leg, not with your hands, with your abs. Seven and eight. Very good. Dance. A. Celebrate that. A. A. <laughs> Very good. Turn forward for me. We're going to go into windmills. Windmills with the legs. Cross your right leg over your left. Here's a windmill. You kick, flash, cross. Kick, flash, cross. All right? So, understand the four elements. The kick, the flash, the cross, and then the very brief landing. Let's go for it. We start slow, but you know we're gonna ratchet it up in every meaning of the word. Let's go. Up, kick, switch. Flex, ah. Up, kick. Up, speed it up. One, two, it's like crossing your legs in a real dramatic way. Five, six, seven. Let's slow it up. Up, kick, switch. Up. Now, the goal is not to touch the back of your chair when you flash. Speed it up. One, two, three. Show me a little leg. Show me a lot of leg. Six, seven. Eight, good. Sit up nice and tall. Good, stretch down. Eight, eight, eight. All right, I promise you that we're gonna get these arms involved some more. So, we're gonna do some floor twerking and some push-ups with our toes on the chair. If you fear that your chair may slide, Try to put it in front of a sturdy base. Otherwise, try to keep more of your legs over the chair. So like, don't put your toes on the tip of the chair. Let me show you what I need. Okay, so turn your chair to the side. All right, you're gonna put your toes into this chair. Okay, this is the setup. Let me move my chair forward just a little, or back. All right, the arms are wide for push-ups. See, I have like a large part of my uh, calves or shins on the chair. Okay, push up, down, up, twerk, 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 down, up, twerk, 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 twerk. Hold it low and twerk, twerk. Two, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Push up, gently come down. Give me a little child's pose. Eight, eight, eight. 
Excellent. Do you have another round of those in you? I want to see it. I want to feel it. Feet on the chair. Hands wide. Want to see it. Six, seven, go. Down, up, twerk, twerk, twerk. Down, up, hold it right here. Hold. Let's catch this new beat. Hold. Down, up, twerk, twerk, twerk. This is four. I'm keeping count. Five. It's a shorter set. Six. Go down and twerk, twerk, twerk. A, A. Your arms are fully bent. You're moving those hips for five. A, six. A, seven. Phenomenal. Hand claps to you. Come on down. <laughs> this is such a great time here. Such a great time. Come on down to your chair or sit down to your chair. Let's have a nice stretch. We're going to cross the right leg over the left. Take your left arm, hug it into your chest and look right. Stretching out those hamstrings and glutes that we worked so hard today. Good, take that right foot and roll it. Reverse, roll, six, seven. Excellent, pick the knee up with both hands. Excellent, switch. Hugging with the right arm now, looking left. The taller you sit, the deeper the stretch. A, A. <laughs> On the flow. Good, roll that ankle. We're staying upright like this just to get the heart rate back down to closer to normal, reverse. Hey. Hug it in. Uh -uh. Good. All right, straighten your legs. Good. Just straighten them. Flex the ankles hard. Stretch out the calves and the hamstrings. I can't help but dance. This music. The music makes it. Excellent. Open up. Take the inside of your arms and press it against the inside of your knees and thighs. Feel that stretch in the groin, in the hip flexors. A, A, A. Okay? I want you to wrap your arms around the back of your chair. Once you do, retract your shoulders. Hey. It's like you're cuffed. No, I don't have a thing about being cuffed. I actually am too much of a control freak to be handcuffed, but it's something nice to think about. It's a good visual, right? <laughs> All right, stretch up. Good, start to sizzle, and then hold it over right. Switch to the left. Good, sit up tall. Inhale up. And then fold one elbow. Gently tug on that elbow for a good tricep stretch. A, A. Come on down, inhale up. Then that elbow, give it a gentle tug. Good, come on down. Offer me a hand. Fingertips down. Gently pull on those fingers. Switch. Good. Inhale up. Walk it around back. Back to where we started. 
Work the hips. Good. Wrap one arm around. Wrap the other. Remove that imaginary shirt. Whip it. Toss it. And give yourselves a hand. Or a pat on the back. Or a hug. If you're mushy like me, give yourself a hug. Either way, you did a great job today. I will see you next time.